This is Quicksilver. This is Quince. Two cats with a joint bank account, which they claim is absolutely necessary because it's the best way of saving their pocket money. Well, I give them pocket money because I think they should have pocket money and they get five pence each every Saturday. And that wasn't enough. So then my sister told me that uh, I should give her money on saints' days. And I thought there were just a few saints, but oh no, my sister gave me 127 saints' days in the year. So that gives them another 127 uh, five, five pence. And then, of course, when Easter came and Christmas came and Whitson came, they demanded more, which they had to get. They must be almost bankrupting you, though. They are almost bankrupting me, yes. I don't know what to do about it, but we'll have to carry on. I mean, I can't let them down now. They've got their own checkbook, and they love helping cathedrals of all sorts, and they're falling down. I mean, poor York Minster. It would have been in ruin by now, I think, if it hadn't been that they sent something. They send things to cathedrals and churches and things like that. Well, look, they have sent to five cathedrals now, or four cathedrals and um, St. Albans Abbey. And uh, at St. Albans, they sent it to the dean's cat, because my sister knows St. Albans very well. And the cat, you see, was, was a cathedral cat, and she's allowed in the cathedral. And so she got a letter from that cat. Mm. And then this last thing, which has started all this, was when she sent it to Ely. And the dean's dog wrote back a thank you letter. Oh. Yes, I was wondering about the reaction when, when a, a check arrives with Quicksilver and Quince. On well, they always send a, a letter back addressed to Quicksilver and Quince, and the postmen like it. They quite enjoy delivering these letters, and I hear the bank quite enjoy it when comes checks come back. It must be unique, though. I've never heard oh, of I'm sure a pair did. of cats with a bank, and especially with their names printed on the checks. Well, I asked. I got a very, very nice kind bank manager, and he was awfully nice about it all. How intelligent are these animals? I mean, they are very intelligent, but not intelligent enough to know what I'm talking about. <laughs> <laughs> but they get the meaning. They well, get the feeling. Well, I of this, like though, to they? think they do, but they, yes. I'm afraid that's just because I'm rather a silly old woman. <laughs> I don't think so at all. I think this is rather a nice uh, uh, thing for someone to do. With that well, it just does mean that you have a little money put aside for good causes. And, of course, the Royal Society of Protection of Birds, this one is very naughty. She really... She almost got rid of all the pledglings. I was very upset about it. But, you see, you must not scold a cat for catching birds. It's their nature. Yes, yes. So they send this conscience money to the Royal Society of Protection of Birds once a year. Mm. They sent a check off yesterday. Did you send a check off yesterday? Yes, you did. Mm. 